We've spent three amazing weeks with family in the States, and now the time has come for the long road back to Japan. We'll spend the last two weeks we have with my parents in Illinois, visiting with many friends and family there before passing our COVID test and boarding a plane for Japan. Hello guys, welcome to Ohio. to our hotel. For happy kids on a road trip, just look for a hotel with a pool and you're all set. The next day we went by an attraction so enormous we just had to stop and take a look for ourselves. Ark Encounter! Whoa, look at this. This is awesome. So we're about to tour the Ark. This Ark is from the story of Genesis, a biblical story about the flood that covered the whole earth. And God spoke to his man Noah, told him to build an Ark. And it's in these proportions. We don't know it was exactly like this, but it was these proportions. And we're going to tour this thing now. They had all kinds of cages for the animals. Whoa! Chips, huh? And Pepsi. I didn't know they had Pepsi and chips on an Ark. <laughs> I'm sure Noah had coffee on the Ark. <laughs> Over here and look up. <laughs> Coffee oh. filter is full. <laughs> We're heading up, up the deck. <laughs> up, up, yeah. the way. Okay, the kids are walking up the ark. Look at the ark. Amazing inside. Maybe his wood workshop looked a lot like this, huh? <laughs> the blacksmith oh. technology. What would it have been like back then? Yeah. We spent the morning seeing how Noah and his family could have survived on the ark with the technology and animals from ancient times. For the adults and older kids, it was fascinating, but the limited stamina of the younger kids kept us moving along. Whoa. That's a loom. That's where they would weave things together, eating and meeting. But even on the ark, we were able to find a few thrills for the kids. came out and wouldn't you know it? It's raining! Oh my goodness! <laughs> what a rainy day, but what a huge arc for a wet, wet picture! Wet, wet picture! Oh. I wasn't expecting a flood when I visited the ark. <laughs> we all got soaked, huh, guys? We were soon on our way again. The next stop this time would be Grandma and Grandpa's house, and we could hardly wait to arrive. We're coming up on Champaign, Illinois. This is my old stomping ground where I lived for one year after college, and I worked at a psychological testing agency. That's where I worked, folks. There it is. There it went. <laughs> and I lived out that way. In the middle of the cornfields. <laughs> we only have one more hour left. Yeah, we made it. What are you so excited for? Fun again that you throw the ball in. Oh, basketball? Yeah. And the most beautiful Bye. chauffeur in the world. There's something so relaxing about driving through the expansive prairies and fields of Illinois. I love it. Well, kids, look, there's Peoria. See all the buildings up there? I'm going to need lots of help to pull everything out of the car. Everything. Yes, Mommy! Yes, Mommy! Yes, Mommy! Oh, there's Grandpa sitting in the driveway. All right. Oh, my goodness. Hey, big girl! <laughs> hey! <laughs> There's some kids very happy to be out of the car. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. 
She looks so different with short hair. I know. Oh, I look so my goodness. bad with short hair. <laughs> oh yeah. Big Jay's shooting, shooting baskets with Grandpa. Whoa! Oh, that's okay. Panda Express! Yeah. First dinner yeah. tonight! Oh, it's oh, oh, the one of so Daddy and Mommy's favorite. Mm. We're watching the Prince of the Popper. My goodness, this looks old, doesn't it? It is old! No, it's not. <laughs> it's not. It's only like 50 years old. Oh, really? Now, Grandma was ready to squeeze a year's worth of fun into two weeks. What are you getting ready for? Like the horseback riding. Horseback riding? No, it goes in the back. I have to go close in the front. Okay, sure. No, the ball goes in the front. Oh, that's cute. How cute, Sarah. <laughs> what happened? Where did this come from? Hello, everybody. Official welcome to the ranch. Don't come over here. There you go. Look at that. How is it up there, Becca? Amazing. Whoa. Becca, you want to wave? Okay. So while the kids are all out having fun horseback riding, Ruth and I are shopping. Oh, that is a beautiful watch, honey. Oh, we want an Apple watch. There we go. <laughs> Giant screen on that. Can you smile? Hi! Look at that. Good job, Anna. Okay, well hold on for your life. Can you do a smile too? We got it, yo. We got it. Let's talk about the insane signs of things in America. Honey, we ran out of coffee. <laughs> Again. Hi. Oh, there's Anna. She feels very comfortable on the horse. And Becca. There you go. Now you're going to give her a kiss? Give him a kiss? Okay. Hold it flat like this. Can I, can I, I want to do it. Not okay, good. I'm gonna throw you up there, okay? Whoa, buddy! He knows how to be a cowboy. Look at you! Hi, how is it? Good? What? Breakfast pizza, eggs, bacon, cheese, and the birthday girl. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday. Happy birthday, 42 years old. Thumbs up. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Happy birthday. Oh, wow. It's so beautiful. It's a sunflower. Ruth <laughs> is going to be 42. <laughs> Joshua, I love you, Joshua. Oh, baby, did you draw those hearts? That's so good. Give a big hug. Okay, one more. Oh. You know what that is? Today's trip is a little over an hour. Not too bad. We celebrated Ruth's birthday and then took a trip down memory lane, going to see our first house and friends that go way, way back. Some pretty houses along the way with absolutely ginormous lawns. There it is, waiting for us. Wow! Look at this. How nice. Oh my goodness. That was mommy and daddy's first house. Oh, there it is. Look. Oh, they took down the cherry tree. Oh yeah, the cherry tree isn't there anymore. Alright, let's head on in guys. Yay! Tell him to say buddy sit. Buddy, sit. Don't give it to him yet. Buddy, sit. Buddy, sit. Sit. Okay. Oh. <laughs> okay, you can give it to him. Shake. Shake. <laughs> Shake. <laughs> Whoa. Wow. We got all kinds of backyard games going on. Whoa. Oh, yum. Watermelon. Oh, 
Oh, is this nice then? We don't get much time with our friends when we're back, but the time we have is meaningful and precious. We value lifelong relationships with others. We're watching a video. Okay, let's it doesn't look this. like they want to go at all. They don't want to go. Joshua's out. <laughs> Joshua. Bye, Joshua. Bye. Bye. He's like, I'm going to drive. Inspired by our Life in Japan videos, good friends of ours, Jim and Rita, started looking for parks around them to explore. And they asked us to meet them on the banks of the Mississippi River at Empire Park to see one of their favorites. Oh, so it looks like there's chocolate. Oh, is that chocolate? Yeah, chocolate. And then plain. Oh, is that, Caleb? Is it good? Oh, yeah. oh man. The Vivian? You like it too? Yes. How is it there, girls? I'll open this one. Here, Josh, with your. Yes. The, the, yeah, I see it's all over your face. You ate it too fast for me to even get a video. Okay, have fun. Go work that sugar out. This is an awesome park. I did it. Let's see. Oh my goodness, you're fast. Holy cow. Oh, that's the tough part. Awesome. Wow. Oh, Vivian, way to go. The park was a blast, and we even had time to get in a couple of flight lessons. Caleb's trying a drone. How is it? Fun. It's fun? Maybe we can use one of your videos. So one thing I absolutely love about America is just about anywhere you go, you can find a garbage can. Down by the river, if you need to throw something away, there it is. I'm going back. Oh my goodness. Okay, I went off, someone said. <laughs> what do you got there, Vivian? Stuffed animals. Whoa, that's so nice of you guys. Oh, what do you oh say? now we have Thank our you. now we have our own version of our little omiyage, a souvenir. Back at the hotel, there was something that had yet to be done. If our hotel has a pool. We will be at it. We will be at it. The kids must swim. So you may be wondering, where's Becca and Anna? I didn't see them swimming. Yeah. Becca. Anna. <laughs> Are you guys chillaxing? Chillaxing to the maxim? In previous trips, we've left chargers before. We've left toothbrushes. We've left... What other things have we left? Not much, because mommy's usually pretty good. Mommy's usually pretty good about checking. So it was a huge surprise that she left her pillow. Actually, I forgot my pillow in another hotel. Mommy cried, because I love my pillow. I brought it from Japan. But I am looking for another pillow. They only make big, fat pillows. I can't find a super thin pillow. But anyway, today, we're gonna be visiting a couple different churches and driving a whole lot. So we just finished our second church today. We had a great time meeting with everybody, talking with everybody. We had to race here. It took us three hours to get here. And now we have one more visit to do. This is Cisna Park, the little city where my father grew up. A city of about 800 people in the middle of the fields of Illinois. We're coming up on the town square and up here was the one place where you could go and, and go to a playground and they had a slide. The grandpa grew up. Yeah, this is the town where grandpa grew up. After more visits with good friends, it was time to move on again. That was the last visit of the day and now we're on our way back home to Peoria. We had to get back to Peoria for our last week in the States and Grandma Ryder had some big fun plans. Wait, can somebody tell me what's happening here for us? We're gonna put this Mentos. Yeah, these Mentos. Wait, 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 wait. My mother was a school teacher for years and did the most amazing science experiments with us growing up and now she does it with our kids. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh no, okay. <laughs> Whoa, that was quite a volcano. It was a coca, it's a coca cola volcano. The Mentos are a candy, did you know that? Uh-huh. Did you want to eat it? Yes. 
Mama said no, though. No eating. That's right. And it's that. for the volcano. The Coca-Cola volcano. Co Three, two, one. Huh. Three, two, one. Ah! My mom waits till the Diet Cola goes on sale and then buys it for these experiments and saves it for when her grandkids come. Here comes Anna Cakes, the last one. Let's see if it can be the best one yet. That's how it should work there, huh? My goodness. Look at all the Mentos, the mints in the bottom of that. My goodness. <laughs> Clean up time. Blast off. A blast off? Yeah, the bottle's gonna fly up the air. The bottle's gonna fly up in the air? They fill it with some water and compress some air in there. And then let it go, whoosh. Hit the compressor, there it goes! My camera lens was not wide enough to capture how high these bottles went. Whoa! Oh my goodness! It is never a dull moment at Grandma's house. The rockets taking off just reminded us of something else taking off in less than a week. Our plane back to Japan. And so it has begun. Yes. To unpack our food. So, what do we shop for when we, when we get ready to go? Cereal. Cereal. <laughs> In Japan, you have rows and rolls of ramen, but here, it's a whole roll of cereal. Look at the girls trying on their glasses. Can you buy these? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Who's excited for ice cream? Yay! Grandpa's taking us to his new favorite place. <laughs> oh my. Here we go, Uncle Bob's. We're at Uncle Bob's getting ice cream. Look at these flavors. Butterfinger Crunch. Oh, Sweet Georgia Peach. Oh my goodness. Chocolate? Chocolate. Sweet Georgia Peach and Turtle Sunday, a half of each. Wow, and Sarah? I got Butterfinger Crunch and Joshua. Chocolate, of course. What does it say, Sarah? Huh? If you like ice cream, do you guys like it? And make silly sounds like, oh no, oh no, here it comes, here it comes. Blurf, go walk, go, 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 do. Aye, aye, aye. We've come out to my Aunt Joy's house. She is my father's youngest sister and her husband, Uncle G. They're farmers out here in the country and it's so fun to come out here and spend an evening here with them and the girls are gonna spend the night tonight. It should be a blast. Whoa, there you go. Pretty hot in there. It's green. Oh, it's hot out here. Whoa. Oh. Turn the wheel. Yeah. So you have like planters and tillers that breaks up the earth and a combine which harvests all the corn. Which one would you like to use? 
Oh. That one, the combine? Yeah. The girls notice the horses. For my girls, the only thing as cool as swimming may be horses. After they got to greet the horses, it was back to the house for a very special dinner. Uncle G is famous for his pies, which we are going to get to eat here in just a little bit. You getting anything, mate? Oh, I am getting it. Look All at that. Right. What kind of pie is that, Uncle G? Over. That's blueberry and peach. And look at this over here. We're shucking corn. Illinois corn. Illinois sweet, sweet corn. corn. I may be biased, but this is the best in the world. Look at it! Oh, it smells so good! There we go, the burgers are going on. They are going on. Burgers and corn. Oh, burgers and corn. Look at those eggs, they look yummy. How is it, Sarah? Very good. Oh, good. Yours is also really good. You're eating that corn on the cob like a champ. Daddy's plate is ready. This is a good old down home meal right here. Look at that. That is a burger. That is a burger. Here comes Sarah. Hey, Sarah. After dinner, the kids got to pick out a pumpkin of their choosing. The choice was not an easy one. Now if you can see one you like, pick it out and I'll cut it for you. Can I yeah. take one? Yeah, absolutely. You like that little one, Anna? Yeah, it's cute. That's the one you want? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's yours. Okay, that one there, that's a beautiful pumpkin. Fine. That's a tiny little guy, huh? Tiny little one. Okay. Now that one is yours to keep. Zoom it in a little bit. Okay, I'll zoom it in. Look at that pumpkin, that's awesome. Oh, why should it spiky so don't pop spiky? Okay. That one there is really Got a white and an orange, huh? Did everyone say thank you, Uncle G. Thank you, Uncle G. You're welcome. It was a perfect evening for a visit. We got some pictures outside before heading back in. We couldn't leave before having some pie. The moment has come. Okay, let's go right down the center here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, this is looking really good. This shirt smells good. <laughs> this is a double effort, right? Eat some of mommy's I'm so pie. Angry. You get Kay. the ice cream with yeah, just ice cream. the pie. Here we go. You want to Ruth eat? has chosen hers. All right. Oh man. Oh. No more video. It's time for me to eat some pie. Getting ready for the sleepover. These are the girls modeling their new pillowcases One, that Android made for two, them. Two, three. Thank you. The pie for the road. Thank you, Uncle G. Oh, you're more than welcome. All right. Thank you, Enjoy. You're welcome. <laughs> oh my goodness. Drop the pump. Oh, are you ready to go, big guy? Yeah, I think you can help hold me. Okay, here, let me help. Let me help. And big guy emerges. <laughs> Go, Becca. Here's Sarah working through the ropes. <laughs> oh, go, 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 go! Way to go, Anna! <laughs> Whoa! And slide on down. There it is. Way to go! Baxter! What do you think, dude? You gonna try it? Let's just see how high you get. <laughs> Splat! <laughs> this is the Iron Coyote in Bloomington, and the kids are having a blast here. And pretty soon they're gonna go up on this high part, but they can walk around and they're harnessed in just in case they fall. While you were out there on that course, you want both of these clips on this cable as often as you can. There you go. Perfect. One there cable go. to another. Look what Beck is about to do. Oh my goodness. Way to go, honey. Wow, Becca. It didn't take long, and they were cruising around the top layers of Iron Coyote having a blast. You did it. Way to go! Kimochi wa nani? It's not fun for 
you? That looks like fun. <laughs> Josh will be the friend over here who's playing baseball with him. Whoa, dude! That was a huge hit, dude! There goes Sarah up the climb wall. You're like a spider on a wall! Sarah's getting some good coaching tips there. How to get up? Wow, Sarah! You did it! All the way to the top! Awesome! Look at that! <laughs> okay, now you just... Yes! Awesome! You look like a pro! Look at that, no problem. Anna, how was it up there? If you get used to it, it's fun. <laughs> oh, that was <laughs> There it is, awesome, way to go. We're about to see some really American shopping. It's pretty awesome, huh, guys? Dude, those are big fish. Now look how big those are. Did you see up there? Look, it's up there. Goodness. Whoa! Mama Chung got a purpose. We gotta, we gotta a purchase. Find kids. Okay, let's go find them. The kids are camping out tonight with Grandma in a TV she built in their backyard. Let's go check on them. Is this the TV here? Oh yeah. Oh wow. That's Joshua, right. you're in here too. It's really, really hot in this tent. It's hot in the well, tent. No, well, Take the blanket off. <laughs> no, let it on. Well, I'm not sure how long that will last, but us adults will be sleeping in beds inside. Yes, in an air-conditioned room. <laughs> as far as I can tell, they're all still in there. So they must have slept there the whole night. Becca, you're awake. How was it, Becca? Good, it was kicking me on my tummy. Hey, dude, did you sleep in the tent? Yeah, how was it? Fun. It was a lot of fun. We're getting ready for our last road trip here in America, going up to visit a church this weekend, and then we're going to go to my mom's side of the family, out to the farm, the family farm, where we're going to end our huge trip here in America. Contact! Contact! remember the words. Are you guys next? <laughs> You guys got a really good writing. Look, good asparagus. Time. I did. Oh, purple asparagus even. Hey, dude, did house. you drive? You did. Life on a farm in Illinois and life in Japan near Tokyo is about as different as you can imagine. But wherever you live, family is important. In fact, farming is in my family, and my mom grew up on this farm where my uncle lives. So it's great for my kids to have this experience before going back to Japan. Okay, Sarah, there she goes. We had such a good time with family at the farm where my mom grew up, but in the back of our minds was the big trip that was only a day away, the big trip back to Japan. No adults allowed. No adults allowed? Okay, how about a camera? Yeah, it's okay. The camera okay? Yeah, I guess. You guess? There was still a lot to do and a little time to do it. Well, we got back to my parents' place and there's deer in the neighbor's yard and we could see it really well. So this is it, our last day here. It's the PCR test. We gotta get, we're gonna do some last moment shopping, packing the bags, having the last meals that we wanna have before heading out early tomorrow for our flight back to Japan. 
Okay, the couple doors on the left. Okay, sounds great. We'll be right in. Thank you. All right, guys, let's go get our test so we can fly. The tests are done. Are done. Oh, everyone's eyes watering. What is the treat today, Joshua? Donuts. donuts. Wait, Look see at that all those donuts. donuts. Oh the my donuts goodness. Donuts come from the right? Whoa. Oh, whoa. Here it comes. Whoa. Almost over the house, huh? All right. Do you like playing baseball with Grandpa? Yeah. With Kids Entertained, we finalized our packing. Packing for international trips is a fine art, one which Ruth has perfected over the years. This is a big part of the process, weighing the bags before you go. They gotta be under 23 kilos each. There we go. Look at that. 22.2. What you got there? Have our negative COVID test. That's right. Now that the COVID tests are taken care of, we can finish up the shopping, the packing, and then it's time to go. There's just a couple more bags to go, and then we're all packed and ready. Oh, yeah, it's dinner time. Oh, hey, dude, are you sitting by Daddy? As we meet around the dinner table one last time, I'm so thankful for my roots. The values that were instilled in me from my youth continue to guide our family. And we're so happy to be able to share this back where we live, in Japan. It still doesn't make saying goodbye any easier, though. And that's a big price you pay living abroad. Do I want to taste it? Yes. Munch, 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 munch. Mm, so good, spicy. Grandma wanted to squeeze in one more project before we left. Oh my goodness, are these pictures from our time here? Just a few that Grandma Yeah, what kind of Wait, why is that? Oh, cool. See a lot of pictures at the end. What fun memories from this summer, huh? These are my two favorite ones. Oh. Favorite experience in this trip. Oh, you guys on the couch, huh? Playing phones at the reunion? Yeah. This is Sarah's American Adventure 2021, huh? Oh, cool. Oh, my goodness. So nice. It's early. We got an early flight to catch. We're gonna get the kids up, gonna get a cup of coffee, and we're gonna be on our way. I'm gonna start a clock right when we get going to see how long it takes from this doorstep all the way to when we get to our doorstep, and we'll see. You ready to go? Let's buckle you in. It's a long flight back to Japan. It is a long flight back to Japan, that is right. All right, so here we go. I'm starting the clock. Start. We will see how long it takes oh, from one door to the next. How many seconds till we get home? <laughs>